Not again! I keep losing this stupid online PvP. Isma! <laughs> what? What? What happened? Help me. Help me win this thing because I suck. <laughs> yeah, you do. <laughs> anyway, we're just we're just here. Uh, we, we just want to teach you some uh, online PvP stuff. So yeah, uh, it's pretty fun. It, it is my new favorite feature and uh, I wanna win. I wanna rank up a little bit high. I, I'm, I'm, I'm very casual. I don't expect that I'm gonna rank very high but I do want to get a little bit higher than where I currently am right now which is rank 5. I mean look at that win-loss ratio. 23 wins in 46 battles. That's like 50-50 and uh, I, I don't want to be that guy anymore. And uh, yeah, it's must here to help me with the uh, meta of the Go Battle League. And if you have played Go Battle League for quite some time now, you would notice some Pokemon appear more than others. Then those Pokemon, those po those are the Pokemon that we are going to be talking about. Mm -hmm. The top six, I think, Pokemon that are common in Go Battle League. Are you familiar with those? Yeah, ones? I know that uh, Altaria is good. Yes. Uh, Registeel is good. Uh, One of the best. Deoxys Defense. Yes. And uh, I keep bumping into Azumarill. And uh, Azumarill is such a pain in the neck. Uh, when I see an Azumarill, it's basically I'm already done. I'm already defeated by uh, Azumarill. So, uh, and have you mentioned Skarmory too? Oh no, I don't, I don't have a Skarmory? Yes, Skarmory <laughs> is also one of the most common. It's it's the least common common among the six, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, and uh, you, but gotta, still... you gotta help me out with the Azurel. I'm pretty sure you have something for me, right? <laughs> yeah, I've been studying the meta for quite some time. Those are the six Pokemon that are common. And if you are familiar with my team, which I would be talking about in my own personal channel, my team is basically anti-meta. It's basically beating every common Pokemon that there is in the meta right now. Mm -hmm. um, if you have an Azumarill, if you have a Registeel, my team is basically equipped for that. Yeah. Um, and today we're going to talk about how to beat those Pokemon in the easiest way possible and usually with little more resources because most I think most of you don't have the resources. If you are a battler that don't have the resources, then this is a great video for you. So uh, first of all, Azumarill. Such a pain in the neck. What can I do to counter Azumarill? It's funny you say that because one of its most powerful counters is actually getting a lot of buzz in Go Battle League. And that is Alolan Raichu. Alolan Raichu right now is um, trending upwards. Mm -hmm. Um, I've encountered a lot of Alolan Raichu. And if you aren't familiar with Alolan Raichu, the moveset that you are going to go with is Volt Switch, Volt Switch. Thunder Punch, Thunder and Punch. Grass Knot. Grass Knot is there, so when it, when it goes against a Mud Boy, which is the Water Ground types, it can have a move that can go against it. So basically, it has the tools to beat the Mud Boys, it has the tool to beat Azumarill, and at the same time, its resistances also make it a sort of soft counter to Registeel and a huge counter to Skarmory. So that's already three Pokemon. Mm -hmm. And I haven't even mentioned it resists counter Deoxys. Mm -hmm. So that's it. I, I got a uh, Lodan Raichu here. I got Volche, Vol Switch, Psychic, and Wild Charge. <laughs> yeah, and I'm going to waste a lot of... I mi mind you... Because of the today. because of the past nerfs that Niantic has done to Alolan Raichu, he has tons of moves. Mm -hmm. He has Thunder Punch, Wild Charge, Psychic, if I'm Psychic. not mistaken, Grass Knot. Yep, I'm gonna waste a lot of charge. Yeah, TM exactly. Today. You know, and, what? I'm gonna try to do it right and now. And the same goes for Fast TM because it has Volt Switch, it has Spark, it has Zen Headbutt, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, Thunder Punch, right? Yeah. Yes. Okay, right, good. That's one and done. Then the just... problem with Alolan Raichu is that it's not, it's not fish. Even though it can beat Mud Boys, it has to hit the Grass Knot. So, with a well timed shield, a Whiskash can beat in an Alolan Raichu. So, yeah, do be mindful of that. Oh, fish! <laughs> I'm running out of charge TMs. Another good counter for Azumarill is 
a personal favorite of mine, Tentacruel. Mm -hmm. you, you gotta give me one of those because for some reason I do not have... Yes, there we go! After how many charge TMs? <laughs> and honestly, I think especially the beginners don't have a Tentacruel. It had a spike of usage during the freestyle during the mid-2019s but it died down because of the nerf of the debuffs if you're mm -hmm. not if yeah. you're not acid familiar. spray right yeah mm -hmm. R right now the if you have played in around february then quit debuffs don't last now so if you switch debuffs will will be removed oh that's pretty cool i didn't know that that's me he's talking about me yeah i'm talking <laughs> about him the one that stopped pre-2019 pre-february 2019 your power up punch methods are now gone because of that back to tentacruel tentacruel has poison jab hydro pump and acid spray if you're going against azumarill you will only need to, sh to use acid spray once acid spray once then you don't have to shield anything because um, Azumarill doesn't have anything to throw at you. The worst case scenario is if it goes full Hydro Pump, it goes two Hydro Pumps at you, which is possible because Azumarill is pretty tanky so it can charge up to two Hydro Pumps. Even then, you would have minimal HP and 90 energy, good enough for a one Hydro Pump or one Acid Spray if you want to shield to beta shield more. But it's cool because Hydro Pump is very powerful even on resisted hit. Trade me. While we trade, I'll talk about another things that Tentacruel is good at because it's not only a good Azumarill counter, it's also a good soft counter for Registeel because if it doesn't if Registeel doesn't have Hyper Beam, which is a very rare move for for Registeel, um, it doesn't have any neutral hits to go against Tentacruel because it Tentacruel resists steel and fighting because of its water poison typing so it can be a great um, soft counter you have to be mindful of when the opponent would shield because if the opponent shields the hydro pump then tentacruel leaves but if you were able to bait in an acid spray before doing a hydro pump hydro pump you're pretty much good yeah you're good um and you're better because a, a shield less reggie still cannot beat a tentacle that's pretty good. that's eye shard lapras right uh-huh thanks i want one <laughs> all right that's perfect then perfect um, before we end with tentacruel um tentacruel is weak against psychic so you have to be mindful of the hypnos and the uh, deoxys with psycho boosts and jirachi mm -hmm. you would know we had no chance with them and the mud boys and also for azumarill a good counter for Azumarill is Meganium. I yeah. know what you're thinking. It's a grass type. Ice Beam. Yeah, Ice Beam. The good thing with Meganium is that it can tank one Ice Beam. Plus, it also has Earthquake, which is you can you can use against stuff like Registeel, which we'll be mentioning later. But the good thing is that it has Frenzy Plant. If you have the Community Day move Frenzy Plant on your Meganium, you should definitely use one for Go Battle League. Frenzy Plant is one of the best moves in the game. Um, even on neutral hits, it go, it's going to be very powerful. Even on stuff like Registeel, it's going to do a decent dent. You you only need to shield one Ice Beam. The other Ice Beam you can tank you can still do decent damage to Azumarill because Azumarill only has Bubble, so it would release Meganium. And Meganium is pretty bulky, pretty bulky. Next up, we have Altaria. Um, yeah, Altaria. that's my favorite Pokemon to use in PvP. That's like my always lead <laughs> yeah and it's good because Altaria has a powerful dragon breath it has the bulk too it has sky attack which is a powerful move so the problem with Altaria is is that it, it's weak to ice type move so basically Azumarill Azumarill I, that's why I hate Azumarill if you already have an Azumarill then go for Azumarill a good Pokemon that can tank both Altaria and Skarmory is Bastiodon Bastiodon the problem with Bastiodon is not that common if you happen upon one you and you cornered an Altaria, you don't need to shield. You don't even need to use a fa a charge move. <laughs> That's true. Yeah. I hate I hate Basiodons too. Yeah, and another one is Melmetal. Yeah, that that's one of the uh, Pokemons that uh, I use too. I try to avoid uh, Deoxys or Registeel. I I basically just use Melmetal because it's kind of good. He's yeah. kind of bulky and uh, he it's sort of bulky and um it has rock slide and the new Superpower, which mm -hmm. is which we would get into to another Pokemon, but we're still on Altaria. Um, and the last one that I should mention for Altaria is also the Mud Boy Whiskash. Whiskash has Blizzard, which is a deadly, deadly move against uh, Altaria. Altaria is easy, easy to counter. You can use um, already Pokemon that are already in your arsenal, and you can even use Ice types like um, Frostlass, but 
you would ha- it would have a harder fit on your team so you can you should be wary of that just use azumarill people who have ulteria like me we hate azumarills next up Registeel. I know, I know you've encountered this because it's one of the most people powerful. People always use Registeel. Like, and, ah. and it's no wonder people use Registeel because it has the one of the fastest charging move in Lock On, mm-hmm. which is which pairs well with all of its moves, which is high energy moves with high damage, flash cannon, and focus blast. Sometimes hyper beam if you want to surprise, mm-hmm. but those focus blast and flash cannon is enough. The problem with with Registeel is that it is weak against stuff like Whiskash again. Whiskash has Mud Bomb, which is a ground type move, which is charged super fast, and in return, Registeel can't hit Whiskash with Flash Cannon. You can only use Focus Blast, which charges way, way slower than Flash Cannon. Another one uh, that is that is good against Registeel is Mel Metal. Like you mentioned earlier, Mel Metal Superpower mm-hmm. is a fighting type move. The problem with Superpower is it, it debuffs. Mm-hmm. It, it lowers the attack and, and the defense, defense each but, time you use it. But I can spam it. If you spam Superpower, um, you would lose attack and defense because of the debuff. But because you are fighting with Registeel, if you've cornered Registeel into a switch lock, um, Registeel will have no other way to damage you except for lock on which re- which Mel Metal resists. So, on a shielded Mel Metal, it can basically beat Registeel if it's spam superpower. It, you can do it if you have the shield advantage and you have the switch advantage because if you are not able to beat Registeel using uh, Mel Metal, it will have still have a lot of health if it if it shielded the charge moves and you can switch out and the debuffs would be gone. And the last thing that is good against Registeel is, surprisingly, Alolan Marowak. <laughs> Alolan Marowak is another best general counters to the meta Pokemon because its fire and ghost typing resist all of Registeel moves, including Hyper Beam. What, what should its uh, moves that be? So it can beat Registeel faster and it can also beat um, Skarmory. Um, fire Spin is the best fast move and it can go Bone Club, then Shadow Ball. And even some people use Fire Blast, but it's it's co- sort of a niche pick. But if you stumble upon a Registeel, you can also use Fire Blast to do with it faster. And for Skarmory too. But Shadow Ball is more neutral. It can hit Altaria. Mm-hmm. It can hit... It packs a punch. It can hit Deoxys Defense, mm-hmm. which is our next Pokemon, mm-hmm. Deoxys Defense. Deoxys Defense has Counter, Rock Slide, and... Psycho Boost, but it can also do Thunderbolt because Psycho Boost, if you use it, you would debuff your attack twice. Yeah, but it's a good it's a good move because it charges quicker. But the problem with Deoxys Defense is that it has to rely on counter, which means ghost types like as I said, um, Alolan, Alolan Marowak oh. can can counter it. But you have to be wary against Rock Slide because Rock Slide is super effective against Alolan Marowak. The best, one of the best counters for Deoxys Defense are Ghost Types and Dark Types. So, if you have Sableye, which is a Dark and Ghost Type, you can use Shadow Claw and Foul Play to beat Deoxys Defense. And there's also stuff like Hunter, which is a Ghost and Poison. So, Counter doesn't do crap against Deoxys. But do mind that it still has Rock Slide, so you have to shield that. But other than that, they don't need to fire that much. It can fire Shadow Punch for Deoxys, and Deoxys would fall even if it shields. It would still have Shadow Claw enough for damage. It's best if you have a Ghost type or a Dark type if you have a problem with Deoxys Defense. If you have a minor, just a minor problem with Deoxys Defense, you can settle with Altaria. You just have to shield once, then you can go Sky Attack all the way. How about we put all that stuff into action? Okay, we got Amazumaril. Yay! Switch to Tentacruel. Immediately. Immediately. Oh. Actually, you should have sh- charged the well. That's my mistake. Um, don't use Acid Spray yet. Um, don't shield. Don't okay. use Acid Spray yet. The, um, hi- Wait until you reach Hydro Pump, then you press Acid Spray. So, you would think that. Oh, I see. That's how you do it. Yeah. Then go, Acid Spray. Oh, that's how you do it. Just okay. go circles. Okay. Yeah, Super then, effective. Then go. 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 Don't, uh, don't use anything. Don't use any moves. 
Ju- don't shield. Don't shield. Don't shield. Don't use anything. Just tap away. Not tap. Ice beam. Yeah, let's stop and do anything. <laughs> yeah, and then hide the pump. No, 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 no. Don't, don't use no, anything. Don't, don't use anything. Oh, I see. Then you can use hydro pump if. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Sip no. That's very mm. hard. Um, Alteria. Um, yeah, Alteria. I should it. Um, but fish. Try to press acid spray. Do you? No, no. no. Um, go Mel Metal. I fish. No, oh, right. that's good. Go Mel Metal. Um, go for Rock Slide. Um, shield anything that it uses because it's probably sh- it's going to be either Focus Blast, Shadow Ball. Um, shield. Yeah, shield. You have to shield that. With Thunder Punch, we're doomed. Fire Punch. It's Fire Punch. Okay, so it's it's still doomed. Okay. You're still doomed, so you need to shield again. <laughs> but, um, but good thing you have the energy advantage too. Mm-hmm. So even if you shields that, you would have the advantage. Uh, don't use anything. Oh, fish. Um, shield. 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 Yeah. Yeah. You need to shield that because yes, par- yes, power punch. And shot the I I I think it would not de- beat that, but better if you have the energy and the health. Uh, um, use superpower. superpower. Yeah. Use superpower. Oh, da, 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 da. oh no! Use superpower again. Then switch to Alteria. That's everything that I needed to know. I won that match because of his strategy by using those six Pokemon that will counter all of the meta Pokemon for Go Battle League. So that's uh, let me let me remember: uh, Tentacruel, Alolan Raichu, Alolan Marowak, Meganium, Melmetal, and Whiskash. Whiskash. I said it. I said it correctly. Yeah. But yeah, rewind the tape. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, man. Yeah. Oh, ew, coronavirus. So yeah, that is everything that uh, that we needed to know. Thank you, Isma. Uh, you're not gonna, the only one who has one. Gonna use some alcohol if because of coronavirus. If you're in Asia, you definitely. Yeah. So yeah, that's it. Thank you for watching video this video, and uh, I'll see you on the next one. Bye bye. Bye. Thanks, Isma. Stop touching me.